Hello Smite fans and welcome to the Smite HUD Editor Tutorial. HUD stands for Heads Up Display and includes all the visuals outside of the actual gameplay, including your items, map, abilities, and more. To find the HUD Editor, hit the Escape key and click the HUD Editor tab. It can also be found by going to Settings, then User Interface, and clicking the Open HUD Editor tab. The editor only works if you are inside a game. To prevent any issues, you should edit your HUD in a practice game, which you can leave once you are finished. If you're a little confused about what a HUD element does, each element has a description at the bottom which explains its purpose. If you're looking for a quick and easy way to change your HUD, use the Scale tool which you can find in the Global tab. By dragging it left and right, you can change the size of all the HUD elements at once. You can move each element simply by clicking and dragging it to where you want. Some elements are automatically locked to a specific side or corner, such as the VGS, player bar, score display, items, and stats. You can also dock an element to a side or corner by clicking an arrow under the Dock to Screen Edge option. To change the size of an element, you can click any of the gray boxes on the corners and drag to your preferred size, or you can drag the scale in its tab. If you want to remove an element of the HUD completely, you can check the Hide HUD element, which will then appear red. If you just wish to hide it temporarily in the edit screen, check Enable HUD Edit or click the green box to the right of the tab. There are a few HUD elements which can be changed beyond size and position, including the minimap, stats display, and team display. In the minimap, you can change the opacity of the map as well as the fog of war strength. To change the team display and stats display, click the drop down tab and choose which display you want. For those of you with OCD, there is a grid option which you can choose by checking the Show Grid box. Make sure to hit Apply once you're done or all the elements will be reset to their previous positions. Hitting the Reset button at the bottom left will reset the HUD element to its original position. Clicking the Reset button in the Global tab will reset all HUD elements. If you prefer the old HUD before the patch, you are able to revert back by changing a few of the options in the HUD editor. Go to the Item Display tab and deselect the Hide HUD element. The box on the bottom right corner should no longer be red. Next, go to the Stats Display and click the drop-down menu and select Stat Only. Then, go to Team Display and select the Original option in the drop-down menu. Finally, you will also need to turn off the Free Mouse Help and Scoreboard Help elements. That's it for the HUD Editor tutorial. Make sure to follow us on Twitter at SmiteGame for all your Smite updates.